Hello, welcome to another vlog. I'm creeping about in the woods, looking for things that catch my eye. And actually, because it's quite a bland part of the season, the flowers are just starting to come out and I found myself a beautiful little daff, little daffodil, um, which stands out beautifully and that's as simple as the shot is. But I've shot it from quite far away, through the bracken, through the brambles and that yellow colour is really standing out, so someone walking past now. But yeah, so I'll take that shot. And you tell me what you think. Walk on, dog walker, walk on. And um, so yeah, just looking for things that stand out, nice contrast in colours. Pretty simple stuff, so I'm just gonna have a wander around and see if anything else catches my eye. down on the forest floor and we found a little yellow flower. It's a wildflower, I don't know what type of a flower it is, but it stands out against the background. It's very small, it's got a lovely little crown shape to it. Green leaves, brown leaves, nice yellow flower. Now that might not be the version that you see because we have had some patches of sunlight coming through. So I've put the polarizer on that takes the glare off the leaves saturates that colour and we get a little dash of sunshine just a little bit of luck we'll get a beautiful image so you might see one with some sun on it hopefully that's going to bring it to life a little bit more but f5.6 soften the background bring that into focus that's a pretty picture pretty rare that you'd see me in some woods without looking at a bit of bark. I've shot these trunks before in one of my very first vlogs, one man and his prime lens. So I can't see any compositions that I would set up on a tripod, but I've put my prime on. I'm just gonna have a wander around and I'm just gonna snap away. Noises everywhere. I'm just gonna snap away. I'll show you some of my favourite shots. We're certainly going to be using the ridge lines and the bits of the bark, so that's what we can uh, come up with, yeah? Sweet as. Here we go, where are we? We're at f2.8. Focus on the ridge line so I can see you in the background, that's no good. Let's get it really close down into the lines. Not so everyone's taste these kinds of shots, but I like them. We're using patterns. We've dropped that focus and that light down. Why? Why did 
I do that. And because we're at such a wide aperture, we're getting 250th of a second, which is fine for handheld. Just beautiful. Ooh, that's a leaf with an interesting pattern on it. That's standing out nicely. Sitting in one of those horizontal channels. Got some nice undulations in the bark here. Nice. Well, hopefully there's one or two there for you to enjoy. So something has caught my eye. Um, get very paranoid. This is a slightly more public part of the woods, um, and it's green. So I've already shot the yellow subjects, the bark. Um, so this is using the colour green. Obviously, there's a lot of green in the woods, um, but it's a slightly different shade. Well, there are slightly different shades of green, but there's a nice group of little spiky leaves. It might be like baby holly, to be fair. Um, and it's surrounded by different shades of green. There's some green moss, there's some slightly dead fern in front of it, some new shoots coming out on the other side. So there's all sorts of different shades of green. And it's nice, if I can get down low enough, it'll be nicely framed at the back of the composition with these other elements surrounding it. So it's gonna need to be low. Um, I'm gonna need to use a tripod because I've got the polarizer on again cuts down the glare and makes the colours brighter. So let's have a look at getting that one all set up. Now I might have to take the centre column out of my iPod. iPod? Oh, my iPod, out oh, my tripod to get it low enough. Let's have a look. Uh, no, actually I don't think I need to. So we're at 5.6 again, polarise. There we go, just takes that glare off. It's a little bit greener. I'm actually gonna, it's quite, they're quite bright leaves, so I'm actually gonna drop the exposure a little bit. So we can get that detail there, it's really nice. No. That's much better, yeah. Focused on the top leaf. Um, yeah. So. As some more people come past, that's going to be my last shot. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you another time. On the grave Cracks of a thousand leaves Somewhere in between Our past and our future Rolling over All the dividing things Are you still listening? Want to be heard